my stuff is all over the place because I'm redoing the furniture. I tell you, it's scary. Just when I think I'm getting organized. But anyway, while I was doing it, I came across this boxed, um, remastered version of the uh, Toys in the Attic album. I was looking at these graphics, which I haven't looked at for a while. And I remember uh, when we were talking about you know, picking somebody to do the graphics. We, you know, sometimes we use the in-house record company. Sometimes there's private graphics companies that do it. And there was one that did covers for Led Zeppelin. So we just told our manager, get the guy that did the covers for Led Zeppelin. That's what we want. So that's what we got. This was our third album. And it was when we were starting to really grow into what we had become because by now the band was really starting to take off. And so we had a lot of input on these graphics and really um, it was so much more of a collaboration than when we first started uh, with the graphic artists. But, you know, we actually went up into, you know, an attic, this attic. We can't see the attic, you can see us. But, uh, and um, that's where we did the shot. So we were in an attic with toys. Toys in the attic.